to Dr. Mix. Today I want to wish Roland happy 50th birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Roland. Happy birthday to Yes, Roland are the kind sponsors of this channel and I could not be any more proud because I am a huge fan of Roland. They are the makers of some of the most iconic electronic musical instruments ever made. To celebrate 50 years of Roland, revered sound artist and designer Yuri Suzuki, more about him later in the video, has created Roland 50 Studio, a free online app that recreates some of the classic Roland middle O instruments, like the TR-808, arguably the most famous drum machine of all time. The 808 was first released in 1980, it generates sounds using only analog synthesis and it has defined the sound of many musical genres, including house and hip hop. Let's check out the 808 on the Roland 50 studio. Here it is, look at it. It's super cool, isn't it? I really like it. And uh, very simple to use, in fact. All you need to do is clear, and then you can check the tempo here, and uh, kick drum. How about that? So, cha, cha, cha. Move a bit slower. And also, you can do fills. Very cool. And very cool that they will also have a TR-606 coming up. Next, the TB-303, a bass synthesizer released in 1981, famous for its distinctive squelchy sound that gave birth to Acid House, Chicago House and techno music. By the way, what is your favorite Roland middle O instrument? Let me know in the comments. Now all I need to do is push this button, bang, and here I get the 303, so I can just play it. And then it automatically syncs up with the 808. Randomize. And then resonance. Randomize. Yes, very cool. Next, the SH-101 monophonic synthesizer, manufactured between 1982 and 1986. This was a portable yet very powerful synthesizer that became the staple of electronic music in the 1990s. Let's have a play with it, shall we? Here it is, so blue. Let's start it, right? And here you got your controls. Arpeggiation here. Yes, yes. I think you can actually run three of these instruments. Uh, so if I go to this and then I play it, I can play this. Yeah, then I can play this. Yes! 
next, the SP, a little bit more of this, 404 Baby, a hugely popular portable sampling workstation released in 2005. It influenced the sound of popular music genres like lo-fi beats and a lot more. I use it live still today. But let's check out the Roland 50 Dot Studio version of it. This comes loaded with some samples like this. Right? Okay? But you can do something really interesting here because all you need to do is press rec and <laughs> say yes and then just use some of this randomly, yeah, and go start. <laughs> I like it. Let's add some more. Let's see what we get. All right, you ready? And you can even add delay. And you know what's incredible? This also works on a mobile phone. That's right. What I really like about this app is that besides being free, it looks a lot like a piece of art. And it's no surprise because it's made by Yuri Suzuki, a celebrated artist who exhibits his work at the MoMA in New York and the Tate Modern and many other museums. His work is fascinating, it's futuristic and very memorable. And he has collaborated not only with Roland but also with super famous musicians such as Will I Am and Jeff Mills. And he designed Roland 50 Studio to have fun. It has an export function that allows you to share your creations online, which I invite you to do now. Also, if you want the full plugin emulations of the TR-808 and more middle O instruments, as well as the entire collection of software synthesizers from Roland, you can check the links in the description. Everything is right there. Yes, happy 50th birthday, Roland. And thank you for supporting my channel. It's a real honor. Please guys, give Roland some joy and some love by sharing Roland50.studio and I will see you on the next episode. Stay inspired. Keep on making great music. Sometimes make moves with your hands, uselessly. It feels great. You know what also feels great? Watching this video. Oh, it feels awesome. Yeah.